what is the percent composition of carbon in sodium carbonate? Well, it's the contribution of carbon to the total molecule. So what is sodium carbonate? Well, it's made out of sodium ions, which have a charge of plus one, and carbonate anions, which have a charge of minus two. Crisscross those because it's an ionic compound. You get Na2CO3. So of the total mass that a sodium carbonate unit weighs, how much is carbon? Well, first we need the molecular mass of the entire thing. We have two sodiums and each sodium apparently contributes 22.99. That's two times 22.990 for the two sodiums. Add in whatever carbon contributes, that's 12. 0.011, and there's only one C in this formula. I know there's no one written there, but no one writes ones as subscripts in chemistry. But there are three oxygens, so we have to add in 15 of the, or sorry, three of these 15.999s. This is the molecular mass of a sodium carbonate unit. It's going to feel pretty big. Let's go see. Two times, 22.99. 2 times 22.99 plus 12.011 plus 3 15.999s. Oh, I forgot a plus. That would have been catastrophic. 105.988. That is the number of atomic mass units that each unit of sodium carbonate weighs. Now, the percent carbon is the contribution of carbon out of that total, out of the 105.988 that we just crunched together, which of those was carbon? Well, it was actually just that one. This here was the O3. This here was the Na2. So it's just the 12.011. So 12.011 out of that total gives me 0 0.11332. Now, when I add these together, I need, well, I have three decimal places, three decimal places, three decimal places. That's why I have three decimal places in the answer. That's how uh, decimal places work with significant figures. And then when I do this division, this has five significant figures and six significant figures, which means I need five significant figures in my answer. I always use the least amount of sig figs when I do division. So the official answer here, when I times by 100 to convert to percent, is 11.332, which means that 11% of the entire unit or molecule, although it's not a molecule, it's a formula unit because it's ionic, 11% of its total mass is carbon. A bunch of it is sodium, a bunch of it is oxygen, a paltry 11% is carbon, but that's the question you were asked. Thanks for sticking with me. This is the way that you figure out percent composition for any atom in any particle. Best of luck.